although it is preferred to use the different exact approaches to differential equations, sometimes they are difficult to compute. Learn how to use Euler's method to approximate results to differential equations here in numerical solutions to CE problems. Euler's method is a computational method to approximate the general or particular solution of first-order differential equations. Instead of directly solving the particular required values through the different direct methods of computation, an approximate may be enough as long as the values are close to the real ones. Say we have the graph of a differential equation as shown. Euler's approximation method can identify points which are close to the exact values. Although there could be some discrepancies, using closer step size may make the values more accurate. How do we get the formula for this method? Say a hidden differential equation curve is shown. An initial point is given with coordinates of x0 and y0. To work with the second point with coordinates x1 and y1, it is observed that x1 is computed by adding the step size from the previous x. The value for y1 is a little complicated though because the distance between y0 and y1 is undefined. Use the slope which is actually the derivative of y with respect to x. It is also noted that slope is rise all over run. So with dy all over dx as the differential equation itself, we can equate this with rise of y as shown and run of h. So y is then computed as the step size h multiplied by the differential equation. The succeeding points follow the same procedure, so we can deduce that x2 will be computed as x1 plus the step size h. Y2, on the other hand, will be determined from Y1 plus H times the preceding function from point X1 and Y1. So as we continue the process until the required X, we can compute for Xn as X of N minus 1 or the previous X and add H. Yn is also taken as y of n minus 1 plus h times the function of x and y both of n minus 1. And these are Euler's method formula. Let's check this simple example to showcase the method. Approximate y if x is equal to 0 0.6 using Euler's method with the equation by using a step size of 0 0.15. Initial x and y are 0. The differential equation is y prime is equal to x plus 3y. Start by listing the given which are the initial x and y of 0. h is 0 0.15 and we are tasked to find y if x is 0 0.6. x is easy to determine as all needed is adding the step size in each iteration so we can start with x0 as 0 x1 is computed as x0 plus the step size giving 0 0.15. x2 is x1 of 0 0.15 plus the step size resulting to 0 0.30. So as you have concluded, x3 will be 0 0.3 plus 0 0.15 which is equal to 0 0.45. Then x4 will be 0 0.60. y also starts at 0 y1 is y0 plus h times the differential equation. So we need to plug the values of the previous x and y into the DE to have the value for y1, and that is y0 of 0 plus the step size of 0 0.15, and this is multiplied by x, which is 0 plus 3y, and that is 3 times 0, and that would give y1 as 0. Y2 is the same using the previous values. 
y1 is 0 plus h of 0 0.15 times x1 of 0 0.15 plus 3 times y1, which is 0, and that would give 0 0.0225 y3 will be y2 of 0 0.0225 plus h of 0 0.15 times x2, which is 0 0.3 plus 3 times y2, which is 0 0.0225, resulting to 0 0.077625. y4 will be 0 0.077625 plus 0 0.15 times the quantity of 0 0.45 plus 3, times 0 0.077625, which would give 0 0.180056. And this is the value we are tasked as this is the value of y when x is 0 0.60.